फॉर कौशल शर्मा ऑफ विलेज शक्रो रहा इन मोदनगंज ब्लॉक ऑफ जहानाबाद डिस्ट्रिक्ट लाइफ हैज बिकम मच बेटर कर्सी टू इंप्लीमेंटेशन ऑफ नेशनल इनोवेशन फॉर क्लाइमेट रेजिलियंट एग्रीकल्चर दैट इज निक्रा इन हिज विलेज Sharma a farmer has total 18 acre of land holding at one point of time prior to implementation of nikra project in his village he had started contemplating about migrating to some metropolitan city for earning livelihood his dejection over failure to achieve desired agricultural growth had led him think about migrating sharma usually had to remain satisfied with low harvest because of his inability to ensure proper irrigation of his crop inadequate water availability had been a major constraint previously in irrigating crops at sakrorha However, Sharma is happy man now. With things have changed for better in regards to water availability. Proper irrigation has helped him register on an average 20% increase in yield of major crops. Sharma is not an isolated case. There are a number of other farmers particularly small and marginal farmers who stand benefited following implementation of the nikra project in sakrorha implementation of nikra project was taken up in sakrorha village in 2011 by kvk jahanabad the village having total 350 households the majority population of village is dependent for livelihood on approximately 250 hectare land resources natural resource management a major component of nikra efforts for addressing problem of inadequate water availability it was initiated in village under this project The Nikra initiative aimed at reducing dependence of farmers on rain-fed irrigation through proper management of natural resources. Earlier, solely dependent on rainfall for irrigations, farmer often had to suffer loss of crop due to erratic rainfall. Allied activities like rearing of livestock also didn't prove to be profitable venture for them in absence of sufficient water exposed to heat stress milk production of dairy animals usually was not up to the mark in most of the cases total 8 dead water bodies located at different places in sakrorha were revived as ponds following implementations of nikra project in village approximately 60 hectare area of village has been transformed into pond the village presently has capacity of harvesting and storage of 13520 cubic meter of water Revival of water bodies has also proved useful in underground water recharging. The water of pond is utilized by farmers for providing supplemental irrigation in paddy crop particularly during dry spell in Kharif season. Increased scope of supplemental irrigation has reduced chances of loss of paddy crop because of inadequate rainfall.
the pond water is also used for pre-irrigation purpose by farmers in Rabi season. निकरा परियोजना के तहत गांव वालों से विमर्श के बाद पांच पाउंड पांच तालाब का निर्माण किया गया बाद में फिर इसमें तीन पाउंड और जोड़े गए अभी के तारीख में कुल आठ पाउंड का निर्माण किया गया जिस पाउंड में वर्षा का जल संचित होने के बाद उससे किसान अपने खेतों में सिंचाई प्लस मवेशियों को पानी पिलाने का भी काम करते हैं In order to further increase the availability of water, check dams were constructed at different places in Pine located in village. Construction of check dams has helped proper utilization of water available in Pine during monsoon. Providing irrigation in kharif crop has become easy for farmers. by diverting water from water head of check dams total eight check dams constructed under the project has facilitated water harvesting in approximately 120 hectares area paddy production in sakrorha has received a boost following increased availability of water for irrigation गांव में भिन्न भिन्न जगह करीब करीब आठ चेक डैम का निर्माण किया गया है जिससे हम लोग को सिंचाई में सुविधा होता है चेक डैम के निर्माण होने से पानी हम लोग रोकते हैं रोकने के बाद सिंचाई में भी सुविधा है और जमीन का जल स्तर भी हम लोग का बढ़ा है जिससे कि आज के डेट में कुआं में पानी बहुत अच्छा जल स्तर हम लोग का बढ़ गया है उससे हम लोग अच्छा कुआँ उपयोग कर रहे हैं कुएँ के पानी को For agricultural fields situated in upland where water cannot be reached for irrigation from existing water bodies miniature water ponds were created under the project utilizing 5% land of each plot of 1/3 acre size to ensure efficient use of underground water sprinkler irrigation system was promoted under the project for irrigating wheat crop in 12 hectare area and pulse crop in 8 hectare area jab se nikra parjana hamare gaon gram mein pravesh kiya hai tab se hum log ko fayda hi fayda hai fayda is mamle mein hai ki khet ka ek hissa 5% bhag mein talab khanwaya gaya nikra parjana ke tahat usme ye hota hai ki barsaat ke din mein jo khet mein pani आता है वो इस तालाब में आके जमा हो जाते हैं ये जमा हो जाने के कारण जब सूखा पड़ता है तो इससे हम पटवन धान के भी कर लेते हैं अच्छा ढंग से अच्छा दूसरी फायदा ये है कि इस तालाब में जीरा जो डालते हैं उससे भी कुछ मुनाफा मेरे को मिल जाता है और तीसरा फायदा यह है कि तालाब के चारों पट्टी साग सब्जी राहर इत्यादि रुपये का चांस मिलता है इससे भी कुछ मुनाफा हम को हो जाता है और चौथा है कि पहले से भी हम मुरी पालन का रोजगार कर रहे हैं उसमें से जो बीट निकलता है वो मछली के चारा के रूप में इस्तेमाल होता है और कुछ धान में भी उसको डालते हैं तो खाद के रूप में भी काम करता है थ्रू इंस्टीट्यूशनल इंटरवेंशन जीरो टिलेज इन वीट एंड डायरेक्ट सोइंग ऑफ राइस हैज बिन ऑल्सो पॉपुलराइज इन सक्रोर Farmers involved in wheat cultivation in 30 hectare area of village have adopted zero tillage technique for sowing of wheat. Farmers have been able to effectively reduce the cost of farming and increase crop production adopting these techniques. With know-how of direct sowing, the farmers are now in a better position to handle situation arising out because of their inability to prepare paddy nursery taking into consideration the problem arising because of uncertain climatic behavior and also for advancing transplanting time of paddy preparation of community nursery by farmers was encouraged 
under the NICRA project as part of institutional intervention. By raising community nursery in 2.5 hectare area in the village, farmers have successfully cut down unavoidable delay in transplantation of paddy. Since farmers started raising community nursery, they have been incurring 30% less expenditure on preparation of the nursery. Increasing crop production providing to be major challenge amidst uncertain climatic behavior. Several measures intended at augmenting yield through climate resilient agriculture were initiated under the NICRA project at Sakroha. Intercropping or mixed cropping one such measure promoted for efficient use of soil moisture and nutrient has proven to be highly useful. Adoption of mixed cropping pattern by farmers has helped them grow two crops at a time without any additional input. Though earlier mainly wheat was used to be cultivated at Sakrorha during Ravi season, however, Taking note of low availability of surface water, cultivation of improved variety of pulses during Ravi season was promoted under the NICRA project. In light of the fact that water requirement of pulse crop is low and it can better withstand drought situation, cultivation of the crop was promoted as part of the NICRA intervention. Cultivation of improved varieties of red gram, finger millet, pearl millet besides linseed, coriander, fenugreek, umum, turmeric and elephant putium was promoted respectively during rabi and kharif season for crop diversification. The farmers of Sakrorha in most cases have succeeded in augmenting their income through crop diversification. Promotion of nutrition or kitchen gardening also undertaken as part of the NICRA intervention has effectively contributed in increased availability of fresh vegetables and fruits besides improving health condition of the village residents. Adoption of integrated farming system was encouraged under the project in order to ensure round the year scope of income generation for the farmers. The suggested integrated farming system modules have been adopted by farmers in certain cases. Livestock improvement and breed upgradation were focused under the NICRA intervention, taking into consideration marginal farmers constituting majority of the population in Sakrorha are dependent on farming and livestock for livelihood. Adverse climatic condition and lack of proper health management had been major contributory factors in high mortality rate of livestock in the village. Animal health camps organized time to time apart from stepped up vaccination drive under the NICRA project has considerably reduced the mortality rate of livestock in the village. Preventive vaccination program was taken up in village to immunize cattle against foot and mouth disease besides goats against PPR disease. Sirohi buck and black Bengal breeds were introduced in Sakrorha and adjoining villages as part of intervention made for breed upgradation of goats. With an objective of increasing income, poultry birds of Banjara, Gramapriya and Jharsim breed were made available to landless farmers for backyard poultry. With the same objective, 
duck rearing was also promoted under the Nikra project among marginal and landless farmers by making them available khaki campbell breed of ducks. Backyard poultry and duck rearing have helped the farmers in economic survival, particularly in situations when scope of livelihood generation is less for them due to adverse weather conditions. Promotion of green fodder cultivation was yet another major step taken for livestock improvement in Sakroorha village. Taking note of the fact that absence of green fodder in feed has been a major contributory factor in low milk production by milch animals, the NICRA interventions aimed at encouraging green fodder cultivation. A fodder seed bank has been also established in Sakroorha as part of the NICRA initiative. Total 42 farmers are presently involved in fodder seed production in the village. A village climate risk management committee that is VCRMC has been constituted in Sakroorha preliminary for capacity building through technology demonstration and other institutional arrangements. A custom hiring center established under the NICRA project is being run by the VCRMC. Establishment of custom hiring center has given flip to mechanize farming. Identification and adoption of climate resilient agricultural practices under the NICRA program has ensured better life for people at Sakroorha village. The interventions have substantially reduced their worries related to farming arising because of climate change in conditions. Following the NICRA initiative, people depending on agriculture for livelihood have become more adaptable to climate-resilient agricultural practices.